Hey guys, it is Charlotte and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So today is the two in one video where we go over what we're gonna what bills we're gonna be paying and then we stuff our cash envelopes and our sinking funds, which are my favorite parts, and I'm sure it is yours also. So before we get started, make sure you go and subscribe down below. To all of my new people, hello, my name is Shirley McMillan. I am a 27 year old, oh god, I'm about to be 28 in January. I'm 27 years old, I do budgeting, meal planning, grocery hauls, anything and everything. I love supporting people, so if you have a channel, let me know down below and I will go and support you guys. Alright, so this is actually my last time doing my plan, this planner, unless I do a recap for my goals. But I did downsize to a smaller planner, which is very sad, but it will save me, me on money on my, like, kits that I get and everything. So, we just have to, you know, bite the dust, see if we like it. Hopefully we do like it. It is going to be a little bit smaller, so I'm going to have to zoom in a lot more and everything, but it is fine. So, on paycheck number two, we made $1,447. So just a little bit, just a couple of dollars more than the first paycheck. So that is pretty good. So in total, because I usually never do this. So in total for this month, I made $2,891, which is really good. Hopefully I can increase my income next year, I am hoping. All right, so four bills. The car will be $198, rent is $293, so it is a total of $588, credit card is $38, student loan is $63, it's like 63 and like 84 cents or something like that, so it's fine. Light bill will be $22. Insurance, it will be $68. Phone, I'm not going to have anything because that is, um, my, I, my brother is paying me back because we split gifts this year, so I don't have to owe any phone bill this month. So maybe I can not, not own anything for my birthday. I have to ask him for my birthday present. Can I not pay for my phone bill? <laughs> that would be funny. And then... Mediacom, I'm not putting anything in Mediacom because Jared said for my birthday present, I don't have to pay for Mediacom, so, which I probably will try to help him just, you know, just to be nice and everything. And then Jim is $17. So, let's tally all of that up. So, $298 plus $293 plus $38 plus $63 plus $22 plus $68 plus 17 equals $699. Is that right? Yes, it is right. <laughs> all right. So that is all the bills that we are going to be paying. All right. So let's flip over. So, our last week, which it will be on this one, because I didn't do a weekly check-in. So, for our last one, we are going to be doing this one. Alright, so groceries will always be $100. Gas will be $60. Fun money, we're going to do $60. Out to eat, we'll do $20. Cushion or my debit card, we're going to do $110. And then seeking funds, we will tally that up whenever we are done. All right. So before we get stuffing, let's just do all of our writing so we can just have a fun time. All right. So for college, we are going to do $50, which it's $472. And then my semester is going to be $480 so I still have two weeks I have, have one more pay paycheck that I can use to buy my book so we're going to do $50 vacation we're going to do 150 
it's actually going to be, let me just show y'all. It's actually going to be $200 because I got a Visa gift card from one of my best friends. And she said I have to use it for our vacation. It was It's a girl's trip that we're actually going to be doing. So we are actually going to go to Tennessee for my birthday. So it's actually going to be $200. And that is with the Visa gift card. Medical will be $50. Car maintenance is $50. I'm coming up on my $60,000 mileage. So that's going to be the most, um, it's going to be the longest one. So they might have to charge me, I think like for the caliber or something like that. I don't know. Last time I had to pay, but we'll figure it out. Christmas. We are not starting until next month. Christmas and Black Friday are both getting zero dollars. Wedding will get eight dollars plus whatever is in my cash envelope. Special occasion will be twenty dollars. Trying to save up for two bachelorette trips and dresses and everything else that I need to save for. Tag will be ten dollars because we need to do tag and then my certification renewal and all that stuff and then gifts will be ten dollars because the next birthday that i have is for my nephew aiden he's turning one so i need to at least get maybe like thirty dollars and that will probably be enough to buy him a gift off of amazon so that would be a fun oh and then beauty and clothing will be zero i'm thinking about combining these two because they're essentially, they're the same thing. I mean, they both go on my body. <laughs> so, we'll probably just do that. You guys, I'm like getting sick, I think. Alright, we're just going to tally all of this up. So, we're going to have 50 plus 200 plus 50 plus 50 plus 8 plus 20 plus 10 plus 10. We equals to $398, but subtract 50, we will need to get $348 out from the bank. $408 plus um, our groceries, which is 100 and then gas, fun money, and food. So I'll need to get $588 out from the bank. Now I have not gone yet because it is Friday and it's literally like 7.30. So my bank doesn't open until 9. So I'm pre-recording this and then I will run to the bank, come back, and we are going to do our sinking fund and cash envelope stuffing. Super excited. So stay tuned, you guys. Alright you guys, so I am back from the bank, and as you can see, I took out $588, so I just did a new setup, so hopefully y'all would like it. Let me know down below if y'all do, and if y'all do, then I will continue to do it like this. So, I just lined up all my bills and then have my envelopes on the side. So, before we get into our sinking funds, we are going to go ahead and stuff our envelopes. So, this is going to be like groceries, gas fun money and out to eat so this is this envelope is from the Dave Ramsey website that I got for ten dollars whenever I no it wasn't ten dollars it was free whenever I joined their financial peace university and it'll be coming up on a year so the first we are going to do is groceries so there is no money in there so we are going to do a hundred dollars All right, and then for gas, we are going to do 60. I have no money in there. $60. All right. Um, fun money, we're going to do 60. So I think I did 50 and a 10. Let's see if we have anything in here. We have a receipt. And then we do have cash, so we have one, two, three, four, and five. So that five dollars will go towards wedding. And then out to eat will only be twenty. All 
All right, you guys. So there you have it. That is the uh, envelope that I'm going to be working with for the next two weeks. All right, moving on. Let's do our sinking funds. For college, we are putting $50 in. So let's see how much money we have. I'm going to have to buy my book soon, or my semester soon. One, two, three, four, five. So that's 500. 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22. So five hundred and twenty-two dollars. I have to write that down real quick. Five hundred and twenty-two dollars. All right, I think I'm going to move this to the side, and then I will get it. So next one is going to be vacation. As you know, I have the gift card that we're going to add. Plus, we are going to add a hundred and fifty dollars. Let's see. So this is going to be Tennessee and what else? Um, Tennessee and Comic-Con, which I need to buy Comic-Con tickets this week. And I think I'm going to be a good Beyonce and buy my boyfriend. All right. So we have 100, 200, 240, 60, 83, and then 20, 40, 50. That's 400. And then 410 and 411. So 411 dollars. Let me put all that in there. <clears throat> so I have to write that down. All right. So next is going to be our medical. So we have some doctor's appointments coming up. We're going to put 50 dollars. All right, gotta get this situated. All right, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30. So $130, which when you see my 2020 goals, medical and car insurance is um, added it's there's a special goal for that so 130 all right car maintenance will be 50 dollars as well fifty sixty seventy and eighty <clears throat> Christmas and Black Friday will not get anything. Wedding, we are going to do eight dollars, five, six, seven, eight, and then plus what we got from our cash envelope. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So thirteen dollars is what we're going to add. This is a big envelope. <laughs> so let's see. Twenty, thirty, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, fifty-four, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine. So fifty-nine dollars is how much we have in wedding. I saw five. Let me put that. I don't know how some of these um, channels that I watch, how they are so smooth with money when they're trying to sort it out and everything. I just can't do it. <laughs> All right. Special occasion is going to get 20. Beauty and clothing will get zero. Tag is going to get ten dollars. Twenty, thirty, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, 
So that's going to be 15. I'll write that down later. And then gifts as birthdays and everything else will be $10. All right, so let's move this over and we're just going to fill in the empty space. So zero, zero, zero. I think clothing do does have, clothing has some money. I should have counted that. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Clothing has ten dollars. Uh, let's see, tag will be 15 and then gifts will be 10. All right, let's move this over. And we're going to do our total. So college is 522 plus 411 plus 130 plus 80 plus 59 plus 38 plus 10, plus 15, plus 10. So that is $1,275 is how much we have in our sinking funds. So I'm just going to add that right here. $1,275. All right. But before I end this video, let me just tell y'all that college will be depleted uh, vacation will probably, most likely, all almost all of it will be depleted. And I think that's it for right now. So those are the two major things that are going to be depleted whenever I see y'all again. Which I think is around the 10th is when the next time I will see y'all. Maybe. I have to double check that. But anyway, so this is my two-in-one video of the cash envelopes and sinking funds. I hope y'all enjoy these videos. Let me know down below if y'all are enjoying these videos. And be sure to subscribe. I would love to get to know you guys. And let me know if y'all have any questions. I will be more than happy to go over it. And yeah, so I will see you guys later. And have a happy new year if I don't see y'all or talk to y'all. And yeah, so I will see you guys later. Bye.